Good morning, friends. First of all, let us look at the global queues. On Friday, the Dow Jones has closed down by 345 points and Nasdaq closed down by 199 points. And as of now, SGX Nifty is trading down by 45 points. So, in the morning in the Nifty, we can expect a gap down opening. Coming to the stocks in news, the first stocks is Lumax Auto Technologies. The auto ancillary company has completed the acquisition of 75% shareholding in IAC International Automotive India through a wholly owned subsidiary of Lomax Integrated Ventures. Accordingly, IAC India has become the step-down subsidiary of the company and subsidiary of Lomax Integrated Ventures with immediate effect. So we can expect an up move in the stock of Lomax Auto Technologies. The second stock is Welpson Corp. Subsidiary Welpson Metallics has received multiple export orders of 43 KMT for pig iron across Southeast Asia and Europe. These orders will be executed within next two months. So we can expect a up move in the stock of Welpson Corps as well. The third stock is Lloyd's Metals and Energy. The central government has granted environmental clearance and Maharashtra Pollution Control Board has issued consent to operate for the enhanced iron mining capacity of 10 million tons per annum from 3 million tons per annum. Company remains confident of mining, handling and selling the total quantity of 10 MMT iron ore in FY24. In addition, the company has also reassessed its iron ore reserves in existing mines and preliminary reports suggested reserves of 180 plus million tons. So we can expect an up move in the stock of lost metals and energy as well. The fourth stock to watch out is Gateway District Pacts. HDFC Mutual Fund, through its several schemes, has bought additional 2% stake in the logistics company via open market transactions on March 8. With this, the fund house increased its stake to 7% up from 5% earlier. So we can expect an app move in Gateway District Parks as well. Thank you.